Searching for a little girl they think may have been abducted. South Bend officers are spearheading a search to find out who this child is. WSBT 22 Suzanne Spencer was on the city's west side today. And Suzanne, a lot of unanswered questions here. Rick, what we do know is that a seven or eight year old girl was reportedly taken by the hand and led away by a black male with a gray beard. Witnesses on the scene said the girl was asking for help as she left. It's a scenario no parent wants to play out in their head. It could have been my child, you know. It could have been somebody else's child in the neighborhood. Fredrickson near Prast. Patricia Scott has lived here nearly 30 years. Witnesses say this alley is where it all happened. It's crushing. It's crushing, you know. It's crushing, you know. I don't even know the child, but I know that it is a child. And it's somebody's child. The young girl described to police as wearing jean shorts, a pink shirt, and sparkly shoes allegedly taken as witnesses looked on and called police from a cell phone. Right now we're exhausting a lot of uh, effort and manpower to try to find this girl. Police canvassed the area three blocks in each direction, searched the sex offender registry, and visited the homes of any possible match. It's scary. It really is scary because there's a... There's a lot of kids on these streets that play, that, you know, usually they play in groups. It's unclear if the girl knew the man or if they were even related, but police don't want to waste any time. We're erring on the side of caution here. We're going to investigate this as, as if it were an abduction until we can come to some sort of uh, concrete conclusion. At the end of the day, parents in the area want this to be a reminder. You cannot be too safe or too careful when it comes to the children. What's notable about this case is that there has not been a missing child reported as of yet. Because of that, police say patrol cars will continue to keep an eye out for this little girl. But the massive search is coming to an end, we're told just minutes ago. Still, though, police are asking if you or anyone you know knows this girl or knows anything about what happened earlier today to contact them immediately. At the live desk, Suzanne Spencer, WSBT 22 News. Suzanne, thank you. The